Hi guys, welcome to Miss Angie's Kitchen. It is the last video of the school year and I'm excited and I'm a little bit sad, um, but to celebrate, we are going to keep it simple and keep it fun. And we are going to make strawberry banana jello. So I have strawberry banana jello and I have a banana. I have hot water and cold water. I have a mixing bowl, a whisk, and my jello mold. So to get started, the directions are on the back of your box. This says to add the powder to the bowl. Your jello powder, and you can do any flavor that you want, and you can mix in any fruit that you want. I just happen to have strawberry banana, and I also happen to have a banana, and I thought that'd be a good combination. So, according to the recipe, you put your powder in the bowl, and you need one cup of hot boiling water. So I have a half a measuring cup, so that means I'm going to need two of these. So I have one, and I have two. And you'll want to take your whisk. Mix this up until your jello powder is gone, until it dissolves in the hot water. I wish you guys could smell this too. Strawberries and bananas, that's my favorite kind of smoothie to get or ice cream combination. I like strawberries and bananas like a, like a sundae. Looks pretty dissolved to me. Then the next part of the recipe says one cup of cold water. So to make sure that it's cold, I even add ice to mine to cool it down quick. Splash everywhere. Now I'm stirring this up. the ice cubes go away and if something happens and your ice cubes didn't melt you can always fish them out with a fork that usually works out pretty well for me so I'm gonna let that continue to just melt away I'm gonna take my banana and I'm going to peel it and they're a little bit on the right side so I don't know if I'll use the whole banana it might be too soft but this would be really good with strawberries, especially right now. Strawberries are in season. Raspberries go well. In jello, soda oranges. Mandarin oranges are one of my favorites. You can mix it all in there and have kind of like a fruit jello salad. So I'm just slicing my banana, putting it in my jello mold. You guys got outside to enjoy the weather today it was beautiful I spent my whole day out there I even cooked dinner out there on the grill all right I think I have enough banana in there maybe one more fingers. Now, as you can see, all the ice cubes have dissolved. So I know that I had good cold water and I had hot water. And I'm going to very gently pour it over my bananas. And next, we're going to want to put this in the fridge until it sets. And I'm looking at our directions here, and it just says chill until set. So when it's ready, I'll show you. All right, I'm back. I went for a motorcycle ride and a walk while I waited for the jello to set. So it's been a few hours. Pull it out. Bring an extra treat to go with it. 
but here's our jello. It's set. And our bananas are in there. So what I like to do is scoop up my jello. There you go. You have jello with fruit and whipped cream. See you guys later.